I, I'm not so sanguine as some of my colleagues here that there's only one life form on this planet. Uh, we have a lot of different types of metabolism, uh, different organisms. Uh, I wouldn't call you the same life form as the one we have that lives in pH 12 base that would dissolve your skin uh, if we dropped you in it. Oh, I've got the same genetic code. We'll have a common ancestor. You, well, you don't have the same genetic code. In fact, the mycoplasmas use a different genetic code and would bit. not work in, uh, in your cells. So there, there are a lot of variations on the but you're, But you're not saying it belongs to a different tree of life from me, are you? Well, I think the tree of life is an artifact of... Uh, some early scientific studies that aren't really holding up. So the, the tree, uh, you know, there, there may be a bush of life. Uh, <laughs> right. Oh. Yes. Uh, bush. Of I tree. don't like that word. <laughs> <laughs> Rich, Richard, oh, but that's only in. Oh, I can see uh, that point. Yeah. 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 Uh, so there is not a tree of life, and right. in fact, from our deep sequencing of organisms in the ocean, out of now we have about 60 million uh, different. Uh, uh, unique gene sets, uh, we found 12 that look like a very, very deep branching, perhaps fourth domain of life uh, that obviously is extremely rare that it only shows up out of those few sequences, but it's still DNA based. Uh, but you know, the diversity we have in the DNA world, I, I'm not so sanguine and ready, ready to throw out the DNA world. I think we're going to, maybe uh, like Richard was saying, we're going to find the same uh, molecules and the same base systems wherever we look. 